This video is going to cover folders and what a folder means in the Elms content management system. So if I go over and we'll open this up, we can open up the menu. And I'm actually working with a folder here, so this is orientation. Uh, to find folders, I can go to my content outline again, the outline designer, and you'll see orientation has a folder icon and that designates that it's a folder. So let's go to orientation, see what that actually does. So if I, using the same page, the same controls as a page, I can go and I click edit content, and you'll see the form is exactly the same. So I still have a title, I can still add uh, content here. If I so choose, it tells me if it's public and what it's going to do to the material. The important connotation of folders is uh, two things. So one, you get a different icon in the outline designer, and that might be kind of a silly thing, but to some people this you know, helps group things more visually. Um, the other implication is, and this has to actually do with content as it's uh, presented to the user. So if I go to orientation, and we'll click view, and that opens up a new window. And you'll see it gives me my material that I've put out, but then it also copies the items that are directly below it onto the interface. So this is kind of saying, Almost, if you think of a book, you're kind of creating almost a kind of mini table of contents page. So here are the things that are contained within this folder. Now, if you don't want it to do that, because you have to define, you have to say things are folders. If I change this back to a page, go to orientation. So now orientation is part of this page. And then we'll open up the orientation again, and we're going to hit reload. You'll see, because it's a page, it now doesn't render the items below it. So from the end user perspective, that's the major function of what a folder is in the system. We do categorize and group things um, in other areas so that you can see folders versus pages or they, you know, they can be referenced in different ways, but that is the major function of a folder is to showcase what is contained below it. So if I go back to the outline designer, I can now change my orientation back to a folder and we'll now see when I reload the orientation page that the items underneath it are visible once again. 